you so much for joining me today once again on my channel so I just finished filming this look and this is actually my first talk through video so I hope you guys enjoy that um, I just wanted to do some different ways of recording just to see which one I'm more comfortable with and I was definitely nervous filming this one but I just I wanted to show you guys this look because it's a look I did on my client yesterday and it was so gorgeous and she's lighter um, skin tone so um, you know this is a look that anyone can wear so I kind of interpret it on myself just using this the exact same colors of course except for the foundation and concealer but everything else the um, the eye, um, eyeshadows the lipsticks except on myself, I topped it with a NYX Cosmetics lipstick with hers. I did a Makeup Forever lipstick on top of the nude lipstick that I applied first, which you will see in the video. But um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Forgive my nervousness once again. And I hope that you guys will thumbs up my video and also subscribe just so that I know that you guys actually enjoy what I'm putting out there. And if you guys have any requests, let me know either comment below or leave a message for me there should be a contact information on my youtube page um the home page so thank you guys once again and i enjoyed making this video and i enjoyed this look so much this is definitely something that you can do for daytime evening um even for bridals so thank you guys once again and i'll see you in the next video bye bye so the first thing I'm going to do is apply a base to my eyelids. This one is the Painterly from MAC. And we are going to apply another base, but I'm just starting with this one just to kind of neutralize everything on the lid. So the next thing I'm going to do is apply another base. This one is the Aqua Shadow Stick from uh, Makeup Forever. This one is in 26E. Um, and I'm just going to apply this only on the lid. And I'm just going to use my finger to blend it out. I'm going to do the other eye. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is to use my sleek makeup and the original palette. Oh, sorry, Au Natural. Looks like this has all nude colors, and I'm just going to use this first color on the lid. that like that and I'm gonna go in with another Bedellium Tools brush this one is their 785 brush to large large eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to use this color right there I'm just going to use that into the crease just to prepare for the darker color So I'm actually using another Bdellium Tools. This one is a very good one. This one is the number 781. And it's a smaller crease brush. So it's just gonna ensure that when we place that color, and I'm, <laughs> I'm going ahead here, I'm using this darker brown there just to go into the crease. And I'm gonna go back in with that same fluffy um, crease brush just to blend the edges. Same thing to the other eye. Wow. 
what I'm going to do next is to go in with a Makeup Forever. This one is one of their Star Powder. And unfortunately, I don't have the color for this, but I'm sure I can find it online. So I'll leave a link below. It looks sort of like this. It's golden. And I'm just going to use that same brush that we used earlier. Pick up a bit of that pigment and I'm just going to dab it on top of that color. Then I'm gonna go back in with my larger brush that I used to blend. And I'm just blending just above the, where I just put that sparkly powder. All right, so that's what we have so far. So I'm gonna go back in now with the Painterly by MAC and I'm going to use a concealer brush to apply to the bottom line. And then I'm gonna go back into my original pa um, my sleek palette and I'm gonna take the dark brown that I used in the crease and I'm just gonna bring that down the to the bottom lash line and I'm gonna use that same brush it's small enough that I can use just to blend it out on the bottom lash line without making a huge mess So I've lined my eyelids and my um, I've applied the lashes. The next thing I'm going to do is to apply a um, skin tone color or a cream creamy tone um, liner to line my inner lid, uh, my waterline on the bottom. And this one is the Waterproof Cold Kajal Scandalize uh, Eyeliner by Rimmel, which I actually really like, and this one is in the 05 Nude. So for this, I'm just going to go over it with the NYX Cosmetics um, lipstick. Pat that in just a bit. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. So talk to you soon.